morning friends I would have friends let's read our Bible to Isaiah 49 the servant of the Lord listen to me you islands hear this you distant nations before I was born the Lord called me from my birth he has made mention of my name he made my mouth like a sh sharpened sword in the shadow of his hand He hid me. He made me into a polished arrow and concealed me in his quiver. He said to me, You are my servant, Israel, in whom I will display my splendor. But I said, I have labored to no purpose. I have spent my strength in vain and for nothing. Yet what is due, for, due me is in the Lord's hand, and my reward is with my God. Now the Lord says, He who formed me in the womb to be his servant, to bring Jacob back to him and gather Israel to himself. For I am honored in the eyes of the Lord, and my God has been my strength, he says. It is too small a thing for you to be my servant, to restore the tribes of Jacob, and bring back those of Israel I have kept. I will also make you light for the Gentiles, that they may bring my salvation to the ends of the earth. This is what the Lord says to him who, has this, who was despised and abhorred by the nation, to the servant of rulers. Kings will see you and rise up. Prince will see and bow down because of the Lord who is faithful, the Holy One of Israel who has chosen you. Restoration of Israel. This is what the Lord says. In the time of my favor, I will answer you. In the day of salvation, I will help you. I will keep you and I will make you to be a covenant for the people, to restore the land and, and to reassign its desolate inherit inheritances. To say to the captives, come out, and to those in darkness, be, be free. They will feel, feed beside the roads, find pasture in every barren hill. They will neither hunger nor thirst, nor will the desert heat or the sun beat upon them. He who, was, who has compassion on them will guide them and lead them beside springs of water. I will turn all my mountains into roads, and my highways will be raised up. See, they will come from afar, some from north, some from the west, some from the region of Aswan. Shout for joy, O heavens, rejoice, O earth, for burst into song, O mountains, for the Lord comforts his, comforts his people and will have compassion his afflicted ones. But Zion said, The Lord has forsaken me, the Lord has forgotten me. Can a mother forget the baby at her breast and have no compassion on the child she, was, she has born? Though she may forget, I will not forget you. See, I have engraved you in the palms of my hands. Your walls are ever before me. Your sons hasten back, and those who laid you waste depart from me. Lift up your eyes and look around. All your sons gather and come to you. Surely as I live, I declare to the Lord. You will wear them all or as ornaments. You will put them on like a bride. Though you were ruined and made desolate, and your land laid waste, now you will be too small for your people, and those who devoured you will be far away. The children born, born during your bereavement will yet say in your hearing, This place is too small for us. Give us more space to live in. Then you will say in your heart, Who bore me this? I was bereaved and barren. I was exiled and rejected. Who brought this up? I was left alone but this. Where, where have they come from? This is what the sovereign, sa sovereign Lord says. See, I will beckon to the Gentiles. I will lift up my banner to the peoples. They will bring your sons in their arms and carry your daughters on their shoulders. Kings will be your foster fathers and their queens your nursing mothers. They will bow down before you with their faces to the ground. They will lick the dust at your feet. Then you will know that I am the Lord. Those who hope in, in, the, in me will not be disappointed. Can plunder be taken from warriors or captives rescued from the fears? But this is what the Lord says. Yes, captives will be taken from warriors and plunder re retrieved from the fears. I will contend with those who contend with you and children I will see. I will make, make your oppressors eat their own flesh. They will be drunk on their own blood as with wine. All mankind will know that I, the Lord, am your Savior, your Redeemer, the Mighty One of Jacob. So, good morning, friends. I'm in 
Isaiah 49 friends um, um, uh, we, uh, we who believe the Lord Jesus and uh, worship him are we are called servant of the Lord and we are chosen by God to to worship him and to follow him so that um, we are going to be blessed by the Lord and if ever that our lives was destroyed from the past the Lord will restore it the Lord will help us as long as we continue to pray and worship the Lord and do what he says and follow all his commands and if ever we get we sin against the Lord we just ask forgiveness and we will not do what we did before so that we will not be destroyed again so enjoy being a servant of God enjoy reading the Bible prayers doing good to others God bless you friends please read your Bible every day and please do not forget to like and subscribe my YouTube channel where we're going to read a chapter of Bible every day where it is the Word of God it will keep us strong for the rest of the day it is a food for our soul we will be we will be stronger and we will be victorious every day of our lives I love you all we are servants of God take care God bless